Hey everybody, this is Steve with Happy Heart Treasures and today I'm going to show you how much we made at the end of the first month of being monetized. And this is not clickbait, I'm not going to make you wait till the end of the video, I'm actually going to show you here very soon. And then we're going to break down the numbers, I'm going to show you how much each video paid and all the details like that. So stick around if you want to see all that. If you just want to see how much we made, just fast forward a little bit. But first I'm going to take one minute just to tell you about our little YouTube channel and how we got to this point. All right, guys, here we go. Okay, here is our channel. My wife and I have a reselling business. We are full-time resellers, and we started a YouTube channel uh, back in, I think it was June of 2001. And here's our channel, Happy Heart Treasures. We have 1.16 thousand subscribers. Here are some of our videos and whatnot. Here's our subscribers. This is Lifetime. So when we first started on June 27th, 2021, we got 13 subscribers. Two and a half years later, and please bear with me. This is my first time using, I'm using Loom to do the screen recording on the computer. I'm going to zoom this in a little bit. All right. Now, January, December 31st, we ended the day with 650 subscribers. And at that point in time, my wife and I decided if we're going to keep making videos, let's go for it. And from an advice from another YouTuber, we did almost a video a day, usually about a video every other day, but we really started pumping out videos. And we decided, let's try to get to a thousand. So we went up and right about here, we released a video that was a frustration video, kind of, because it, it was about small YouTubes not being seen. And then we really took off and jumped up, jumped up. And then on January 13th, we hit a thousand subscribers. So it took us 13 days after we, uh, from to go from 650 to a thousand subscribers. I'll show you what grew and what we made since then. Go back to our channel and then we're going to go to our videos. Here's just a list of our videos. And then we're going to go to analytics. And you can see right here, estimated revenue right here. This is it. $56.11. Now, stick around. I'm going to show you a lot of details about how we got to that $56.11. But if you look at all these numbers around here, this is all in the last 28 days. This revenue is only since January 14th. So this is all in the last 28 days. So this is views. So if you look at the views, see this starts, this is 28 days. So this starts January 5th. And this is just views. If you see down here, this line here, this is, shows you when we put videos out and what the video was. And if there's two, then I did a short also. And so that's, you can see how many videos we did in the last 28 days, okay? Okay, let's get to the revenue because I know that most of you came just for that. So here's our revenue. If you look here, we were not monetized on the 13th of January, that's the day we hit 1,000 subscribers. So we didn't get monetization for that day. We got the next day. And the next day, we made 82 cents. So how did we get to $56.11? I'm going to show you. I'm going to show you what video or videos really pay the most. I'm going to show everything here. So this is only from January 14th through January 31st. So that is 17 days. I, I wanted to do a whole month, but this is just easier because they do everything at the end of the month. So in 17 days, we're at $56.11. First day we showed up, uh, it takes two days to process or something like that. And the first one we showed up showed 82 cents. And we're like, wow, we're going to be rich. Not really. Uh, then $1.19. And this is actually, it, this actually shows each day how much we made every single day. $1.86, and then we had a good day. We were at $3.87, and then back down to two nineteen. dollars and the average here is about $2 going around. Now, the way I figured it, you have to, in order to get paid at the end of each month, you have to hit $100. If you don't hit $100, they roll it over the next month, and then you get paid on top of that month, too, if you hit $100. So I figure if you hit $3, this one here, $3 every day, then you'll get right about there. You'll be you'll get a check every month. Is what kind of what the how that works. So we went along, cruising along, and then we put out a video that was paid fifty dollars, fifty five dollars for a abandoned storage unit video. That one has done phenomenally. 
And that's where we really saw a jump from that video. So we were 407, 636, 486, and then we made 1049 one day. And then the last day of January, the 31st, we made $5.70. So you can see we've put out a lot of videos. Before this, I didn't put out like any shorts. I didn't do shorts. I tried like two or three, wasn't really that interested. Let's take a look at the videos. First of all, here's the most viewed. There is a short from storage units, and I got 4,222 views. And then I actually, on the 24th of January, I bowled my first perfect game, 300. And the bowling alley always films the 10th frame, and so I actually put a short up of that. And that got 3,808 views. Um, so that was really cool. However, weirdly enough, it's got a bunch of likes, and somebody, like, thumbs down and down liked it, or whatever you'd call that. And I'm like... Weird, but I don't care. It's it's interaction. That's great. So here's that video that found cash money, $55 made in storage unit. It has 2,895 views, which is an insane amount for a long video, long format video. And then this is the big problem for small YouTubers. This is the one that really got us to a thousand subscribers. That one came out January 1st when we decided we were going to push for a thousand. It has 2,857 views. We're going to go up here to revenue. Sorry. And here is just, this is just all about the revenue. And here is January, $56.11. Let's see, top earning content the last 28 days. Let's click see more. And don't worry about this graph. It gets kind of confusing. But we're just going to jump into here. This is that $55 for an abandoned storage unit video. And this one got us $27.32. Let's see, our total is $51. $56. So that is just under half. So almost half of our income from this period of time came from one video. It, and the reason why this video was an hour and 10 minutes long and it has really good retention rate, like the average view duration is like 25 to 30 minutes, which is a lot longer. So when people watch longer, they see more ads, whatever, blah, blah, blah. So that's why this one has done so well. Um, now, just because it has views does not mean, so here's we're going to add views, and then we still need to, you know, sort it by revenue. So now we're still sorted by revenue. Okay, so that video has 2,895 views. Um, the, but the estimized monetized playbacks over here, it says a monetized playback is when a viewer is shown at least one ad impression when watching the video. A monetized playback also counted when a video abandons the video during the pre-roll ad. So it's not as many... I don't know how they determine this, but it's only less than half. Yeah, less than half. So 2,895 total views, only 1,239 of them are monetized playbacks. I don't know how that works, but that's how it works. So from these 1,239 views, monetized playbacks, um, we made 25.44 off watched ads, um, and then $1.89 off YouTube premium. That's way over here. That's if people have YouTube premium and they pay so they don't have ads, you get a little bit of chunk of their $15 a month, uh, a penny or two off of that, and it gets added in. This video right here paid us almost half of it. Then we had the snow squall video when we had a snow squall, and that one has got 407 views, and I'm not going to worry about the estimated monetized playbacks. I'm just going to go through 407 views, and it made 394 so significantly less money. Um, because they're shorter videos, the retention time isn't as long or whatever. Uh, Vero question, that one got $3.92. Full-time resellers explain their business. That one is $2.98, or I'm sorry, $3.15. How to ship a large collectible doll sold on eBay, $2.59. It only has 212 views. Um, we bought over a thousand records. That has 452 views. I really thought that one would do better, and it may someday, but so $1.98. This is where it gets interesting. There's a couple things I wanted to point out. Thermal printer decision. I published this on January 3rd of 2023. So that's a year ago. And that one is $1.91. That's one of my top performing videos for revenue. This video is silly. It's really a what sold video. And I had come across a Rolo and a Mun Bun. And I, it looks like a, like an unboxing and comparison to decide what you should buy video. 
It's actually not. I just came across the second printer. And so I was like, what should I do? And I made that the title. People go to it thinking that it's a comparison video and it's really not. It's just a what should I do video. And for some reason, the analytics on this, if I show you this, here's the analytics on that video. And this is for a year. And it just continues to go up and up and up and up and up and up. And it just doesn't stop. I, I've gotten 16 subscribers from that video. I don't understand it, but you know, does it look like clickbait? I guess, but I'm not going to take it down. And it's doing really well. And the other thing I wanted to show, I thought that was very interesting. The other thing I wanted to show is shorts. So I didn't do shorts before we got into this, uh, really pushing and, and trying to get to a thousand. I started doing shorts and they get a lot of views. So I just want to show what they have paid compared to the videos. So the average video here, here's two videos ago. We're at $1.67, you know, so we're at like a dollar, two dollars, two and a half dollars, three dollars, you know, right in here. But then if you go down before you finally hit the first short, the bowling one finally, finally bowling 300 perfect game. That one got 3,808 views and it made 61 cents. So, you know, it only took me a few minutes to post that, but it obviously only, you know, doesn't make as much. Now this short, it's a storage unit. This is uh, the teaser video for the storage unit video. It got 4,222 views and it made 41 cents. So I don't understand how it all works. Shorts don't have your estimated monetized playback numbers. They're just shorts, but they do still go off of how long they viewed it. But this one, the bowling one has 3,808 views. This one has 4,222, so 400 more views, but the bowling one made 20 more cents. I don't understand it. Maybe it's just uh, congratulations for my perfect game, I guess. I don't know. And there's a couple other shorts, then 20 cents, 19 cents. And then there's random things in here that are old videos that, you know, they're trickling in too. Because if somebody watched it once you're monetized, then, you know, you're going to get credit for that view and everything else. I wonder what the oldest one in here is. There's another garage sale transformation from November 2022. That has, that got a view and I got eight cents off of it. I don't understand it, <laughs> but, but whatever. Um, here's our hoarder house video. Got 18 views, got eight cents off of that. Our first YouTube video. There we go. Published January 20, June 27th, 2021. It's had 13 views and we got seven cents off of it. So that's it. That's what I wanted to show in 17 days. We got $56 and 11 cents. However, half of it is from one video. So would I love to go find some more good storage units and have some more spray storage unit videos? Yes, but we do all kinds of different videos. We do what solds, we do thrifting, we do garage sales, we do storage units, we do all kinds of things. And so, you know, we're just going to keep plugging away. But hey, that's it. That's the answer you wanted, right? What we make. So if you took that and added another two weeks onto it, it might be $75, I'm guessing conservatively. Uh, in the past, we've talked about we don't show our financials. Uh, we don't talk about them because for various reasons, it's just really nobody's business. But I wanted to show, okay, we're monetized. So what are we actually making? And this kind of gives you an idea. And then when something really takes off, you know, it can really add up like $10.49 one day for a small channel like us. Pretty crazy. But anyway, so here's our dashboard. We are at 1169. Uh, it just keeps creeping up. There's our latest video. You see the little fireworks. Oh, this is cool too. Look at this. I found, I'm, this is my first time using this recording thing. Look at this. I can say, Hey, look at our video is number one. And I can hit this button. And look at that. How fun is that? I can have my own confetti throwing. Okay. That's pretty much everything. That's what I wanted to show you. I might have forgotten something I was going to show you on there. If you have any questions about any of this, this obviously is very new to me, but I will answer any questions if you have any, uh, or try to anyway, but. You know, people always comment on YouTubers always comment, oh, you don't get much for doing this. It ain't, it ain't as much as you think. You know what? It's not. It's not a lot of money. I'm not replacing my income or anything like that. But after doing this for two and a half years and not making anything to do it, 
it is kind of fun to see the numbers add up and they do add up and so we're gonna keep plugging along and maybe someday it will be bigger numbers but for now that's it for now i'm gonna get back to the reselling portion of my life and get on with my friday because i got listing to do on ebay today so thank you all for watching if you're interested in reselling type of videos, go ahead and subscribe. That would be awesome if you did. Um, we do all kinds of dumb stuff and we're just kind of try to be fun, but without being stupid. So that's kind of our thing. We just try to be real. Anyway, I'm dragging this on too long. Thanks for watching. Appreciate it. For Happy Art Treasures, I'm Steve. Donna will be on the next video. <laughs>